is holy, and I want all of us to examine ourselves very carefully as we come to dine with the Lord this morning. For I have received from the Lord that I also delivered to you. That the Lord Jesus, on the night when he was betrayed, he took bread. And when he had given thanks, he broke it. And said, this is my body, which is for you. Do this in remembrance of me. In the same way also he took the cup after supper, saying, This cup is the new covenant in my blood. Do this as often as you drink it in remembrance of me. For as often as you eat this bread and drink the cup, you proclaim the Lord's death until he comes. Do this always in remembrance of the Lord. Amen. Amen. The ushers will be bringing the bread which is the body of Christ and the wine which is the blood of the Lord Jesus when they bring it please don't rush to take it we are one family and therefore we will all take it together and as you are being said this is a very separate moment you want to be in the spirit you want to keep praying Pray for the touch of the Lord. Pray that through this the Lord will strengthen you. receive yours, you can still continue to be in the spirit and be praying. Stop presenting yourself before the Lord, yielding completely unto me. Pray that the spirit of God should rest upon you, but this is not that this is not just going to be a formality, but to achieve a spiritual purpose in your life. If everybody has been said, can we kindly be on our feet? If you have been saved, you can kind of be on your feet.
body of Christ this morning, every sickness in your body has to vanish. Every situation that is imperfect shall be perfect. Every situation that is not complete shall be complete. Let down the blood and the bread unto the Lord and declare that may it bring strength unto your body. May it bring wholeness unto your body. May it bring perfection as it enters into your mortal body. In the name of Jesus. of the Lord Jesus Christ take and eat. In the same way also to lift up the cup which signifies the blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus was shed for the remission of our sin. The blood washes away every sin, every infirmity in your life. And the blood can bring strength onto your body. As you take this blood, know that every sin, every guilt of sin that is in your life, the blood was shed on the cross to erase them all in the memory of them. The blood of the Lord Jesus Christ, take and drink. Now you want to continue before the Lord in worship. We just want to continue before the Lord after you have taken this two emblems in worship. We just want to bless the name of the Lord. We just want to raise your voice and thank the Lord for a time like this for his divine observation among us. Yes, thank the Lord, thank the Lord, thank the Lord. Bless the name of the Most High God. We worship you. We worship you. We worship you. We worship you. Thank you. 